morning, good afternoon, good evening, good night, wherever you may be. Overlord, um, I've heard the, like, I've, in movie conversations, I've heard this title mentioned a few times, but, you know, again, offhand, I'm not sure what exactly it is. Um, so let's just go ahead and jump in, see what we have. Months ago, I was cutting grass in my front yard. And the mailman shows up with a letter from the army. Now I'm here. No idea where I'm gonna end up. Questions don't have good answers. There's a lot of soldiers out there. There's only four of us. I got us inside that cop out. out looking kind of like a war movie but it's a war slash horror movie obviously some type of experiments gone wrong possession infection type thing so uh looks like it might you know something more like a oh, okay i happen to see it on again you know streaming as i'm just looking for something to watch and check it out but who knows you know there could be another trailer that makes me think otherwise. Now, I'm very curious to see someone I saw in there. If it's who I think it is, uh, not in there. Let's go to IMDb quickly. One second. Do bear with me. One second, y'all. As I thought so, uh, Ian the Castecker fits from um, Agents of Shield. I was like, I knew. I was like, wait, is that fits? <laughs> so, oh, okay, that's like really awesome. Um, so, as I love Fitz, um, or the actor uh, Ian, um, that that gives a, another uh, leg, if you will, up for this film. Let's see, seeing if there are any other noticeable names to me. Uh, no others that are sticking out, but I mean, from what we saw in the trailer, it looks like an interesting cast and everything, and that that just uh, adds an element for me because one thing, whenever I, you know, there are shows that I love, I'm always interested to see what else 
the stars of those shows do. Um, and in the case of Agents of S.H.I.E.L.D., I mean, you know, the only two that I can think of in a lot of things, and actually it now makes me think about may go to their IMDb pages to see if there's anything else on, on their uh, agendas recently. I mean, of course they do, you know, a lot of them do smaller films or TV or, or whatnot that I may not know about offhand, but of course Clark Gregg, who's, of course, is completely separate now, sorry, <laughs> a rant, Clark Gregg, who's Agent Coulson, you know, and Clark Gregg has been in, uh, you know, uh, so it's a number of uh, films and, and shows, just, you know, smaller things, of course, Ming-Na Wen, you know, uh, voice Mulan, and, you know, it's been in uh, various little shows and stuff there, but you know, as far as, um, like I said, Ian Fitz, um, Simmons, I forgot what her name is offhand. Uh, it's going to kill me. Elizabeth. Um, and, um, you know. Ah! And so I got on the tip of my tan, of course, tan tongue, Daisy, which will I'll come to me in a minute. But, uh, you know, each of them, uh, Chloe, <laughs> Yeah, you know, I'm always interested to see if, you know, would be interested to take a look into something else they do. So, that, that whereas a minute, you know, at first I was kind of like, okay, man, Overlord looks okay, but realizing that is Ian, and that gives me, okay, well, I have to give this a watch if it, you know, pops up on streaming or whatnot. Anyways, sorry for the little tangent. Um, as always, feel free to share, subscribe, hopefully like, rather than just like, um, and... Feel free to leave me a comment. Let me know what you think about Overlord. I mean, obviously, uh, I'm sure, kind of as I did the video for Hellfest a minute ago, there are certain people I know that will also be interested in that. Um, others that may not. Um, let me know what you think about this video, suggestions, or comments. Uh, always appreciate constructive criticism. So thank you once again for watching.